Hey everybody, Sniper Lazyman here. Welcome back to Let's Play Drakengard. Alright, so in the last episode, we did a little bit of flying and running around, and I just maybe crushed the dreams, uh, furthermore, of every Xbox fanboy while getting smacked along with pigs this episode. So, uh, let's go on ahead and try to uh, get away from these guys. Now, apparently, if I got the numbers wrong, apparently there's a chest here. Um, but I kind of don't believe it. Uh, as you want to know, I'm, I'm pro I probably got my... I probably got, got, got it all wrong. But let's just uh, hurry up and get away from these guys. Actually, wait. Let me make, let me just make a quick check because... Because hmm, I have a feeling... Okay, you know how, you know how in like the Roman numerals... How, you know, like, like from, you know, from like 1 to, you know, say 15 or something. Everybody, does everybody know how, how that works? Okay. Because in my notes here, I have verse V1. Now, is that not 6? In Roman numerals, is V1, or VI, is that not 6? Because if so, we are on verse 6. Now, problem. It tells me to go northwest... Uh, from my from my location, I could not go northwest. There's an invisible wall. In fact, I'm gonna actually go head back because I I just like because I feel like it. You know, it tells me to go northwest. And oh wow, two experience. Wow, I would have never guessed that. Okay, because. Northwest is obviously not this way, but I have to head. Guys, stop it! Stop! Stop! But okay, there's, yeah, there's supposed to be another weapon here. Now, if if I'm going the right way from my starting position, which was around here, north. Yeah, my starting position was around here. See, there's just an invisible wall. So unless my notes are wrong. I can't do anything. <laughs> uh, and apparently, see, just, just yeah, it's, it's, I can't, I can't even go northwest. There's no northwest to go into. It's just go northeast. Hmm, this is gonna bug me. Because unless my notes are, unless the internet is wrong. Okay, I'm blaming the internet right now. Unless, unless the internet is wrong. And V, and, and they actually put VI instead of like, you know, some, it says something else. I'm pretty sure that's six. And I'm pretty sure that it might be wrong because there's, there's nothing, there's no chest, there's no point where you can go northeast during this section. You know, it's running the opposite, it's running the complete opposite direction of where I want to go. were killed by a dragon. So, to the Empire, the Goddess will be there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we established that. A flashback of a dragon killing people. Pretty sure we established the fact that his parents were killed by a dragon. Just how apparently Ridley killed Samus' parents in other M, but that's for another day. Anyways, a man whose parents were murdered by a dragon, a dragon who feel who feels nothing but contempt for mankind, a chasm of distrust, a chasm of distrust between them. The two battled the Imperial army. Can they be allies only in war? That is a good question. That's why, and that's why time was so. Uh, you know, that's why he took a second, second uh, thought of making a pact with the same beast, with the same kind of beast that killed his parents. If your parents were killed by, like, a dog, for example, let's just say your parents were killed by a dog, would you help another dog, like, out of, out of, you know, out of, like, like, like a bear trap or something? Yes, it's, I'm taking it right out of Resident Evil 4. But take that, take that scene from Resident Evil 4, for example. 
if Leon's parents were killed by a dog of say the same exact or say the same exact nature, same exact uh, dog, would you act if you control Leon? Would you actually save that dog if you knew that? I would guess that you probably would. But you know, go into his go into his, his shoes here. A dragon kills your parents. You then have to team up with one in order to live. Would you do it or not? <laughs> uh, these are some the deepest questions you can ever c come for in a Let's Play. Not really. <laughs> okay, yeah, so this is the, uh, um... Oh, yeah, I remember. I know this weapon. I love this weapon. Okay, basically, uh, this is a, a glaive. Glaive? I'm, I'm not really sure the exact pronunciation, but the magic attack, basically, it just puts you, it just puts a pool of, uh, I don't know if it's just, like, magical acid or something, but it'll basically kill anything that comes in contact with it. Of course, I'm already fairly strong at this point, but if I would be like, hey, boom, done, everything that, that touches that circle is instantly dead, and they will constantly be keeping, getting damaged over time. So that's that's pretty good. Hmm. That chest, th that weapon chest now is going to bother me because it says that it's supposed to be in, chap in uh, chapter four, verse six. I was on chapter four, verse six. There was no way for me to go northwest. I don't know. It's 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 weird. All right, come on, dude, dude, stop. All right, where do I? I know you guys can. You guys can probably hear my clicking of my uh, of my P of my PS2 controller right now. But eh, come on, stop, stop. Hopefully, it's not too annoying. But I mean, it's not like I can really go out and, and it's not like I, I can really do anything about it. I found the P. I found this. I found this controller. I wouldn't say as long, obviously as long as my PS2 because, you know, it, it comes with, it, it did, you know, it obviously did come with its own controller, and if I if I remember, that one got broken because remember too, these were, this is the time before stuff was wire before stuff was wireless, at at the time when I got, uh, at the time when PS2s came out and stuff, that was kind of a time between where. You know, not having to connect a wire to your system was kind of getting, you know, sort of new. Now, I don't mean like brand new because obviously, you know, they were doing some of the same stuff during like NES and, and like NES days and whatnot. But I, I would say where they perfected it a lot better was days like, you know, when I got the controller. Um, all it takes is just two batteries and there you go, you got a wireless controller. Before I had the, you know, before I had like the stupid, like, uh, five, I, I, I can't remember how long the cord was, I don't know, like, like some, some like three foot long, uh, cord, and that's all it had. That's all it had for the PS2 controller. And, oh my god, Red Goblin State scared the crap out of me. Actually, I don't know which scare, scare the crap out of me more, these guys or the Red Goblins? No, 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 no. 126 experience. Damn. All right. Yeah. So see, obviously, this guy was couldn't couldn't even come over to me because he was trying to uh, he was trying to walk towards me and kept on bumping into the uh, that poison ring. Well, at least that's good. I can take them out with one with one hit. So the best thing to do right now is to, is to be to push them into it. But it doesn't stay out that long, unfortunately. Alright, so we got a few more to go through. Not too bad. Red goblins, get away from me. S stop. Actually, let me... Before I keep on going off, um... I should probably check out some of the other weapons. Problem is, I really don't remember which ones I haven't tried out yet. Well, I mean, duh, I, I have some leveled up. Obviously, I should have to have showed them. Alright, so we've seen uh, Fang's Glaive. Let's go ahead and try out Wisdom right now. 
you know, it's the only one. It, it might, it's the only one right now that isn't uh, level leveled up. All right, that's that's kind of cool. Um, I don't want to use match attack right now. Wow, is it weak? I mean, holy crap, is it weak? Um, no, 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 no. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, please. <laughs> it's, it's so... No. Oh my god, it's so weak. But with a staff, what can you expect? Alright, so what's the magic attack? Oh, okay, it just sends... Uh, some... Some magical... Just It just shoots a magical beam. Not even a beam, just a letter. It shoots a letter at them. A letter at them. Okay, wisdom was a bad choice. That that was a bad choice on my part. Uh, let me switch back. Um, let's go. Yeah, let's switch back here. I'm going to need health pretty soon. This is getting a little bit tight on health right now. All right, one guys, take you down quickly. Good. Keep on dropping a little bit of health. I'm. I'm not going to uh, say anything bad about that. I think they they kind of always drop some the more you hit them, and it's as far as, and it really it's, it's not really as much as you know. Oh, you have to hit them this many this many times. Uh, like you have to keep a chain going on. I think in some way like it just gives you a better chance if you like keep a chain um, going. See like right there, you know, like I, I kept a, a chain going on for ten for ten. Uh, uh, Hits or something, so I guess I can I get some health back. But and I mean that's one thing you you kind of always want to do with this game is build up a chain of uh, of combos because then that gives you more uh, experience. The longer you keep a chain going on, the more experience you'll gain for that. War, war is a road. So, I, so I mean that that's so that's something you know, so that's always something to. Uh, Ah, uh, excuse me. I just something to add. To keep in mind, if you guys ever, if you guys actually uh, can find this game, I don't even know if you can. I'm, I'm sure you, I'm sure you could probably find it on, on like you know eBay or Amazon. Probably, preferably Amazon. Only because now way you don't actually have to fight over it with other people. Yeah, I never, I, I never understood the whole thing about eBay. Like, sure, you get much, you can find pretty much anything on eBay. Well, the problem is, there's probably majority, you know, there's high chance that whatever you're looking for, there's at least like 50 other people who are looking for the exact same thing, and then you're going to be fighting over it with with bids. To me, I never find the purpose of that. But you know, if you want to find something very, I guess, rare that you couldn't just find in a in a store or something like some collectible, you know, video game uh, figure figure or something that. You know, in store at the time would cost like I don't know, fifty bucks or something. Goes on eBay and then it's it starts off at a cheaper price, but then everybody puts and starts putting in money, and then oh look at that, it's now up to like a hundred bucks. So now somebody's not, so somebody at the end of it's going to be not only going to be paying uh, two more than twice as much for it originally, but they're going to be but they're going to be just get, getting it by at least fighting. With, with fighting with them with uh you know like 15 other people can you stop okay you have now been declared my new uh least favorite enemy god these things are huge too no 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 stop ah uh, stop it there Go, 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 stop, stop, stop. Alright, magic. I guess that's a good thing too, is that if he uses magic in a corner, every single time they get hit, they'll they'll uh, get you know, they'll move backwards. So if you put them in a corner and then activate it right next right on top of them, they will literally have nowhere to go. Zero. They will have absolutely nowhere to go, which is fantastic for me. Stop, 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 stop. Please stop. Oh come on! I want to hit. Oh come on! I <laughs> I did that. Okay, I'll admit I did that at a terrible spot. So I will I will not put anything against uh um against these guys. Even though I guess technically I should. All right, last one. 
And here we go. Magic attack. And good. Hopefully, uh, finish this up. I could probably start stop the video. Uh, I shouldn't say hopefully, but you know, finish the level. And uh, we'd probably uh, probably stop the video pretty soon. Nine minutes, huh? Hmm. That seems to go by pretty fast. Yeah, that definitely didn't seem like it was the. Uh, I mean, right now I'm up to you know 15 and a half minutes. That does not seem doesn't seem right. You know, time just time flies way too quickly when you're let's playing. Let me read its mind. The goddess, the empire, a fortress, a fortress. Where, where under heaven? Scream. If that is the fairy's death cry, then the three seals have been broken. Only one seal still remains. That is the goddess herself. Are we too late? We must fly to the lands of the Empire and then find the fortress. Yeah, good job, guys. You've been chasing after I Know Heart this whole time, and two out of the three seals that remained were uh, were destroyed. Great job, guys. Fantastic work. All right, so I should probably reorganize a little bit on what I want to use for uh, for weapons. Um, I know right off the right off the bat, I should probably uh, I should probably get I should probably get the few that I have to level three. Um, to level four, and then just base the side on which one of those level four weapons I should use. Because I'm not going to want to go into a battle with the weakest weapons. I want to have at least one or two weapons that are, you know, are fairly leveled up. Uh, Tyrant's hammer, maybe not. I'm probably thinking of Kaim sword, uh, only because it's again, it's possibly one of the the best sword, the best weapons in the game. But uh, yeah, so I will uh, probably end it there. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, next episode we will uh, probably uh, do another flying mission. And um, uh, as the Dryden, I believe, said, probably fi uh, go ahead and find where uh, Furry Eye is. Make sure that she isn't uh, she isn't uh, killed or anything. So uh, yeah, so uh, for the time and the Dryden, we sign off.